All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Kami Con Communicates episode five. I do not have anything to say before the start of this episode, but I'm just very much looking forward to it as always. Um, so, as always, guys, like the video if you like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's get into this episode right now. I love how they introduce this every time like this. Oh, wow! <laughs> I love like, I love Najibi. So this is just everybody's reaction to Komi in the morning. <laughs> is there something weird? No. I think it might be because that you're not wearing a jacket. Ah, yeah, yeah, that's... <laughs> I thought that's why, because she was going like this. I was like, what does this mean? <laughs> why is this Why is this girl speaking directly to us? What the hell? <laughs> Gym uniform and ponytail. Ah! Oh, Komi's really good at fitness. <laughs> Komi's really, really fit and um, good at exercise. I like how she's going up against Komi and everything somehow. She's still going to get smashed by Komi. Komi's not even like a sprinting position. Is, is she winning? No? Oh my god, Komi is just barely breaking a sweat. Hell yeah, Komi. You are great at everything you do. <laughs> she makes everything look so effortless. <laughs> Komi has no fucking idea what's going on. <laughs> Ever doing that in the slightest, absolutely. <laughs> okay, make up this story in your head. Go on, then. I don't even know your name. Who are you? <laughs> Congratulations on your first arrival, Kumi. Uh, you want to go around to our house? Uh... Oh, she's battling with herself. <laughs> oh, she's so cute. Najimi really just likes to throw her in the deep end. God damn. You know. No. Which one? <laughs> Is this a brother? Oh. Is this a mob? Oh, and she's nothing like Komi. Holy shit. She, do she doesn't look very old, to be fair. Oh my god, this is the first time she's had friends over. <laughs> oh, I love her. Hell yeah. <laughs> Komi's so funny. She's so embarrassed by her mum. So, Komi, you want to talk about your mum or...? Aww. <laughs> oh, mum coming in clutch. The goddess of salvation, yes. Imagine me, you're so creepy. <laughs> Nothing's happening. <laughs> oh, like a mature couple. That's cute. I like comfortable silence with certain people. Oh my god, she's gonna go diving into Komi's private life. Oh. Oh. <laughs> she's got books on how to be good at conversing and stuff. <laughs> this is the most embarrassing thing Kobe's ever had to go through. I love how in all of these pictures she's in her meme phase. Bye bye. Oh, you done well today, Kobe. You checked another thing off the list. Is she okay? Is she happy? Oh. She's got some pictures with her friends. Holy fuck. Oh, she's so cute. She wants a photo frame for her first friends with pictures. Oh, I'm gonna cry. Your dream is to go to a ramen shop. That's quite the dream. Holy fuck, what is this aura? <laughs> 
Kermia probably has like a massive appetite. <laughs> She's, is she like obsessed with food? Yeah, I thought so. What? Eh? Eh? Really? <laughs> Holy shit, this place is strict. Ooh, this guy. This guy can make some noodles for sure. <laughs> that was so quiet. <laughs> oh no, she has to speak. Maybe she can just speak really quiet like he can. Oh, he got it? No way, he gets this right. It's going to be like the coffee shop where he gets it wrong. Well, Komi seems to be okay with it. If all goes well, this is going to be Komi's new favorite place. Never have I wanted so much of a full 24 minute episode of Komi just eating ramen. That was truly a delicacy. <laughs> Did she just... It looked like she just walked into a window. Was that uh, an animation mistake? What was that? Oh, these guys were staring at Komi too much. Oh, she likes it there. Fuck yeah. <laughs> you guys just got smaller portions. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh my god, that armband. I know this person's personality already. And an eye, eye patch? Yeah. I've seen Psyche. Uh, are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> I knew it. I knew this personality, this person's personality as soon as I saw it. Chunibu. I assume that just means like a, <laughs> a game and nerd person. I can't even, I didn't even see her real name. <laughs> <laughs> he used to be like that, oh my god. You are closer than 10 meters, you know that right? <laughs> She's actually adorable, oh my god. Nobody's ever kind of questioned it more. I think she's just asking to be a friend, Kami. You should say yeah, even though she's weird. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Naka, what's her name? Naka Naka? What's her name? Oh my god, we're seeing Tadano's one. <laughs> He's got like main character syndrome. Is this, is this kind of what it is? Operation Air. <laughs> Oh my god, it's this, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I thought you were so cool. You had that kind of fake it till you make it confidence. Oof. Bro got shot down hard. Oof. Bro, you need a hug. Najimi, go and hug him. Uh, so this is the moment that set him on his normal life. Oh. <laughs> yeah, teenagers think they're special. <laughs> like main character syndrome. Poor Tad, I don't know. He has to be reminded of that. Oh, he's dead! <laughs> yeah, that wasn't going to work out for you. Oh, if Komi actually makes the effort to come over to her, I will probably cry. Oh. <laughs> oh, Komi, you're so sweet. Oh, I'm so proud of her. This is such a big step. She's offering her hand without being told to. Oh, she's so sweet. Marta Tri Uesna, the dark dragon. Okay, whatever that means, but you want to be my friend? Oh, she's so sweet. A blood pact has been made. <laughs> oh. So I wait for you, bro. Let's go home together. 
As I say, I've taken your umbrella, the Phantom Thief. <laughs> oh, guess you got to share. Komi makes such big strides every episode. I'm so proud of this journey that we are going through. I do love these guys' relationship, how they act with each other, because it's just very normal. And there doesn't need to be romance, however, I don't know if I would mind if there was romance in the future. But I know that's not really the point of this story. I like how he holds the umbrella fully over her. She's noticing this, though. They are really sweet together. <laughs> He's such a dog. Alright, so that was Komi-san Can't Communicate episode 5. Uh, that was a really sweet episode. It was nice to meet this new character. Um, I've forgotten her name. It was like Naka Naka or something like that, I'm pretty sure. Uh, but I'll learn her name for the next episode. Uh, she just seems like a really sweet character. Obviously a very different personality kind of trope. Um, to obviously introduce in the show. We already know this kind of personality. As I said, I recognize the armband and I recognize the eye patch. Um, and it just kind of reminded me of can't think of his name, but from uh, Psyche-san, or Psyche-kun, the, the guy with the blue hair. That that kind of personality I've seen before, and it's really funny. Um, so it's cool, and uh, it really it was I was really proud of Kami this episode, obviously offering her kind of hand to, obviously wanting to be her gym partner by herself, uh, and recognizing that, and obviously waiting along for Tadano as well, it was very cute. Um, but yeah, definitely looking forward to seeing, uh, to continuing on Kami's journey of, you know, being more comfortable around people, and getting the courage to do things, new things, um, and yeah. Anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, I certainly did, and I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching, have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.